So season 10 is coming up inside of Roblox Bed Wars and the leaks are looking absolutely insane. So I can't wait to show you guys today all of the different leaks we have for season 10 in Roblox Bed Wars. Now this is going to be a big season guys. So make sure you subscribe right now if you're hyped. So the first leak we have is actually called the pyro underscore test kit. Now obviously this is not going to be called the pyro kit but it does look really really cool. The design is unfinished as well which may be why the textures are oh messed up on God. the head. But let me just eliminate this guy first because he's creeping up on me and I don't like it. You're dead, mate. Finished. You're done. But yeah, it could be a kit skin for the pyro, maybe. Possibly. I don't know. Like a battle pass kit skin. Like, uh, that would be cool. It's got like red hair as well. Red and white hair. It looks pretty funky. Bro, this guy's getting snowballed to death right now. I can't lie to you guys. Bro is not dodging them. But yeah, maybe this kit will be in the battle pass. Who knows? Hopefully there's a different change to like the battle pass and stuff as well in season 10. I'm talking like more tiers and cooler rewards possibly. Like we get the same thing every season, you know? Why not switch it up a little bit? So we've also got a leak for the Hecka kit. Now this is a kit that will be added into Roblox Bed Wars season 10. It looks really cool and it is kind of Egyptian themed, which sort of like links with the theme of the season as well. It's got like the golden white colors. The Hecka kit oh, looks awesome. It's got like feathers on the shoulders. It just looks like ugh, it's worth a million dollars. And of course, the Hecker kit comes with Hecker abilities. Now we've got the Mending Canopy Stop Charge. Honestly, I have no idea what that means at all. Probably the kit's gonna charge or something. Like the Dino kit, I don't even know what's gonna happen there. And then we've got the Mending Canopy Charge, which I'm guessing is what you're gonna press to actually charge the thing. Who knows, you could go flying, lads. This kit does look really awesome, and I'm definitely like sure this is gonna come, because it literally matches all the theme of the season as well. It's just brilliant. So I'm 110% sure that this is going to come in the season. Next up, we've got the Tinker Robot. Now, this is for a kit called Tinker, which is actually a mech kit. So it's like a robot, right? It's pretty exciting. Oh, and we've got him, boys. This guy is completely finished. I'm not going to lie to you. He's done and dusted. Absolutely finished. No way. This guy's got the gold IPS cape. This guy is rich. Anyways, the Tinker Robot looks really, really cool. And the tier one Tinker Robot has like a wooden like effect to it. I'm guessing like it's um a like a bronze. I mean leather, leather, not bronze. But yeah, I'm super excited for the Tinker kit. This kit could take over season 10. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Oh, who's gonna win the PvP? Yo, I'm coming in for it. Nah, bro. Sorry, man. Sorry, man. Yo, there's also a pyro grenade for the uh pyro test kit. Honestly, I don't remember pyros having grenades, so this could be new, resulting in that test kit not being a um kit skin. Yeah, a grenade would be awesome. Awesome. I don't think there's been a grenade in Roblox. Okay, that did not happen. Yeah, I didn't um, think there's a grenade in Roblox Bad Wars before, so maybe it's a first. Oh, he just fell in the void. Nice. We've also got all the Tinker Mech tiers. So that looks like there's silver, diamond, emerald. Silver, I mean iron. Oh my days. You're not getting away from me today, Budstar. I know you got dripped out in that um, gold cape. Another leak we have is actually capture points. Honestly, have no idea what this is for. Looks pretty cool, though. We've also got the dragon egg. A dragon egg, I don't know. It could be for a kit. I'm not gonna lie. I'm pretty sure it is for a kit because I don't know what else it would be used for unless there's like a live event or something. And in my eyes, it does look like they are bringing back a lot of OG items, guys. This guy's also got the IPS strip. Oh my days. Because they're bringing back balloons and snowballs, possibly. Glitched enchantment table as well. And if you remember the glitched enchantment table, I forgot what season it used to be in, but it was OG. It used to give you a glitched enchant as well. We've also got the golden goose. I don't even know why this is here, but you know what? We're moving on. Potions as well. Who doesn't love a good old potion? And guys, you might be happy to hear this, but the snow cone machine may be returning. Oh my days. Can you imagine the OG stuff comes back for season 10. That would be a dream. Like the snow cones, I remember those in ranked, man. If Roblox Bed Wars devs actually bring it back, I, uh, I'll be so happy. I'll be over the moon, lads. And not only just the snow cones are coming back, relics are coming as well. Relics, guys! Bro, they were the OG, OG stuff. Who doesn't love a good old relic? Oh, he decided to leave the game. He had enough. So this is the Runic Divide relic. It's got a little crit strike behind it. It's a fallen 
Italian red man. Oh, it looks cool. Oh, he's rushing up on me, bro. I don't think so, my man. I don't think so at all. Where has oh. he gone? Oh, into the void. And guys, not only the relics, not only the snow cone machine, the traveling merchant could be returning as well. Now, if you remember the traveling merchant, it used to spawn in the middle and it came with like a headhunter and stuff. And, like a bunch of upgrades, I'm pretty sure. Now that is beautiful. That is what I'm talking about. That's what I'm excited for, lads. And the vending machines are returning. I honestly forgot all these items existed. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. It's been that long. But I'm super happy that they're returning because I have been missing them a ton, even though I forgot about them. And we got some more relics. It's called the Relic Head Start and the Relic Knight's Code. Oh, this guy, I don't know what he's doing, bro. What are you doing, my man? He really thought he was getting my bed there with an axe. I don't think so. Oh, and he left the game. He had enough. And then we got a message from RGL Leak saying season 10, question mark, question mark, question mark. OG season, question mark, question mark, question mark. And a bunch of removed game stuff leaked. Oh, it's exciting. But now I've got some lobby stuff for you, like some awesome lobby builds, which is what the lobby is going to look like. So it looks like a gold and white theme. But the first thing we've got is the notice board lobby asset. This could probably be the leaderboard, I'm guessing. It would not surprise me if it was. It does look very majestic as well, so I like it a lot. And we've got a bunch more lobby stuff. I don't even know what these are. There's like a statue and there's some pillars as well. And a really cool like portal thing, which looks probably like the AFK portal. I'm not going to lie. And then we've got like a statue with a globe in the middle. That looks really, really awesome. It kind of looks like realistic as well. That's what I like about it. I'm not going to lie, guys. I love that. I love it. Also, we could be seeing a falconer headhunter. Now, I'm not too sure what that is. It could just be like a kit skin or something. Like, you know, for a kit and it just comes with the item. Yeah, you know. It does look cool. It's got like a little couple of feathers on the top. It's got a nice little design as well. We've also got an overcharge like battery. I don't even know what this is. Probably an ability coming up. And then we got the gliding ability. Ooh, these are probably for kits as well. Or they could be relics, maybe. Possibly. Don't quote me on that one, though, lads. And we've also got a fully updated garden wall lobby prop. This looks really awesome. It doesn't even feel like Bed Wars anymore. It feels like I'm in like a... S I don't even know, actually. Because now I know that a lot of things are coming back. And that has excited me. So make sure you subscribe and like right now or you're going to miss out on Season 10. Also, a massive Season X leak is that this Season 10 trailer was released. It's sort of like a little 30-second teaser to show you like some things that are going to be in the season. So as you can see right here, we have all of the kits in the lobby. Now you might be wondering, are these kits new? And boys, this kit over here is a new kit. I'm pretty sure it is called the ghost kit. You can also see that the clock is going back in time. It's not going forward, it's going back. Look, there's a closer look at the ghost kit. That will be a new kit in the season 10, as I showed earlier on in the video. 